What's up, buttholes? James Reeves. Glad to be here doing Mailroom 30, whatever, whatever this is. This is the first Mailroom I've done since TFB TV got a million subscribers, which I'm pretty proud of. So I figured we'd open it up with the traditional greeting. And if you remember, way back when I did Mailroom number one, we started this thing off with a Miller Lite. So we're going to cross over a million with a crisp, delish Miller Lite. Mmm. Ah, oh, tastes so good. So today, well actually today is last night because I'm filming this the day before April Fool's Day. And I was supposed to have this big thing planned where I was going to announce that we were going to fly one of you down in May to New Orleans. I was going to take you out on a bro date. We were going to go hang out. Then we were going to go to the range and we were going to do like a film a video out there and then i was going to give you a gun that's what was going to happen and that still may happen it's just not going to happen in may and that's because i suck at this job this crossing over a millions put a lot of things into perspective and I, there's no way to say it without being lame but i'm super grateful for you guys you do so much for me and yet I do so little for you. So um, I'm grateful pretty much every day. I'm lucky enough where I've got two jobs that I like. I practice law and then I come home at night and I talk in an empty room to a camera. <laughs> it's kind of sad, actually, with me and my cats. But I love it. Wouldn't change it for the world. Um, so I owe you guys a trip. One of you, maybe two of you. We're going to figure something out. I'm going to make it up to you. I'm really sorry. Uh, shittiest content creator in the history of content creators. But the good news is we finally got like our secret patch, Mark IV. We got that in. It's actually really, really dope. Like I want to show you guys. It's right here and I want to show it to you so bad. Um, and it is the first one. It came from IR Tools and it is going to be IR Reflective, which is really neat. They wanted like 30 bucks each for these things, but... Uh, Black Dots, Mike, I see you out there. He negotiated a pretty good deal for us. So we got some really nice kind of pricey patches. So hopefully it makes up for the fact that we haven't had secret patches for a long time. Those are the patches. We only do 100 of them and then we're done. So we've already done 300. So there's been Mark 1, Mark 2, Mark 3 all on the board behind me. This is Mark 4. We've got 100 of these. When they're done, they're done. And then we're moving on to Mark 5. Just one of the many perks we have for our Subscribestar and Patreon supporters. Subscribestar.com slash TFBTV. Patreon.com slash TFBTV. Haven't posted shit. We did like a great giveaway last month, but I haven't posted shit in weeks again because I'm a piece of crap and I don't deserve you guys. We do patches. We do belt giveaways, we do gun giveaways. The first time you hit 30 bucks, lifetime, Patreon subscribe star, you get our writer's patch. 60 bucks, you get the OD patch, and that's kind of a funny thing that there's no rhyme or reason to it. We just kind of rotate in a different OD patch, so those are actually pretty rare too. And then finally, we have the secret patch, which is every multiple of 100. Then we do a $100 Blue Alpha gift certificate giveaway. That is every Patreon, every Subscribestar supporter. You're automatically entered into that drawing, and only you. No one can manually enter that because it's below the dollar limit where it's not a lottery. So it's only for you guys. But for guns, we have to open it to everybody. But if you're at the 5 or the $10 level, you don't have to do a damn thing. You're just automatically signed up every month, and we give away four guns a month from our sponsor, Top Gun Supply. So right now we're giving away three $100 gift certificates to Blue Alpha. Go get yourself a nice belt, maybe two. I really like the EDC carry, like the low profile one, one of my favorites. I have two. Um, I think you get two of those with 100 bucks, or you can get some fancy gussied up gun belt. Those are great too. If your name is displayed now, or now, or now, you just won a $100 gift certificate. Uh, pay attention. Um, if your email's on file, I'll email you. If I haven't emailed you, you email me if you just saw your name flash on screen. All right, now for the big one for our gun giveaways. Guys, I apologize. Supply's been limited. So it's like if we're out of guns, we've been giving away $350 Blue Alpha gift certificates. And if you don't want a gun or if you don't want one of the guns we're giving away, you can just opt for a $350 gift certificate. Uh, use that. 
but we've had some pretty sweet guns lately, notwithstanding the fact supply has been a little bit squeezed, but you're going to get something no matter what, especially if you are one of these four people, number one, number two, number three, number four. Congratulations, guys. It's the least we can do for you. Top Gun Supply, they don't give TFB money. They don't give me money. The only thing they do to earn that sponsorship, that coveted TFB TV sponsorship, is they give guns to you every month. That's it. All right, that was at least five or six minutes of just dicking around. So let's open some mail. All right, let's see what the oldest letter I have in the stack. Ooh, November 2020. JC, Roswell, New Mexico. Hello, James. I just found your channel about four months ago. Man, you're a funny motherfucker. I love the content you put out. I value the gun advice you have to offer, as well as the funny bowl you spin. See, that's what I like. You know, a nice appreciative viewer right here. This, this guy seems like a pretty good guy. I always have a laugh while watching you put out the serious, valuable stuff real men need and want. Ooh, this one's taking a, a dark, dark, sticky turn. I'm a military veteran. I firmly believe you're a good dude and have nothing but respect for our men and women in uniform, of course. Dude, you make my day with all of your funny videos. I'm glad you're watching it. Makes my day, dude. I have a Springfield 45. I have a Springfield 45. The man has a Springfield 45. A Springfield 45. Been a good, reliable gun with a few hiccups. That's not a good, reliable gun. It's a few hiccups. I have a Springfield 9mm and a 357 Taurus. This, this, this is how we treat our veterans in this country. Jesus Christ. I wish this were an April Fool's joke, but he sent this in November. Keep up the good work, dude. This is an indictment of our country. Thank you, Johnny. I know it's a cliche, but thank you for your service, and I hope your life improves. Let's open a package. This is sus as fuck because it's one of those, it's, it's from Azaris Blue, Exceptional Skin Care. Dude, I have no problem with exceptional skin care, but I'm worried. Like, what is this? Oh, oh, we got a silky little bag. Can't wait to put the contents of this silky bag on my silky bag, if you know what I'm saying. Hey James, this is Dr. Tammy Herman. I'm the founder of Azaris Blue. Azaris Blue is a line of organic and luxury skincare. I was wondering if you wanted to go a bit outside the box. You seem like that kind of guy. Smiley face, what kind of guy? If you try blue and you like it and mention it to your subs, give them a code so they save 10% off of their entire first purchase. What's... Where's the goddamn code? I also wanted to send you some blue to thank you for your time and effort with TFB TV. Love to watch your vids. Very informative, very entertaining. Feel free to contact me to discuss and with any questions, I'd love to hear from you. Thanks so much for your time. Hope you have a very happy and healthy new year. Warmest regards, Dr. Tammy. After all, guys need to pamper themselves too. Well, I guess you wrote into the correct mailroom because I am the kind of guy who would actually use skincare. Got a little hand sand, got the old silky bag here. Let's see, a little face cleanser, little body drench lotion. I normally just use mayonnaise, but that looks like it's pretty good stuff. And a coffee body scrub. This is where I draw the line. I will never use a body scrub. I'm sorry. Uh, Dr. Tammy, as you probably gleaned, I am a man who will use a moisturizer, and I do on a regular basis. I draw the line at body scrub. Too much work, skeptical of the results, but Lindsay will probably love it. Look at me, I'm just gonna be pampering my ass off, possibly literally. <laughs> God. Um, hand treatment cream, I don't do that either. Serge cream, ultra moisture, Serge cream. Wonder what I use this for. Um, to my face, neck, and decollete. Decollete, what is a decollete? Anyways, Doc, you didn't send me the code or whatever, I guarantee you, you're going to get max two sales. But here's the important thing is that, you know, you guys, you're always free to send in stuff from like your small business or whatever. Um, I don't want to cut. I don't want a referral code or none of that shit. 
you know, like send your stuff. We've always been doing this. Like send your shit in. Um, come and, and drop a link in the comments or whatever. Like I'll post it up or I'll pin it, whatever the case may be. Uh, I guarantee you none of these incel virgins that watch this program are going to be buying any of your products, but it still means a lot to me that you sent them in. All right, let's speed this up. I got to put some moisturizer on my dicklet. This is from my buddy Johnny, Johnny B at Shall Not Comply. Johnny sent in some of his merch. Got some of his patches. I actually have all of these patches and stickers. I'll put these in the giveaway pile. In fact, it's um, like high time for a giveaway. So maybe tomorrow, if I say it on camera right now, then I'm gonna do a giveaway for April Fools tomorrow, then I'm gonna do a damn giveaway. So um, I'll include this in the merch I'm giving away. Johnny put on here, you are everything I wish I was. We say sweet things like that to each other. Love you, Johnny. Hope to see you soon. We got one from December from East China. Michigan. Dude, China's not in Michigan. Oh my God. Hi James, Beavis and Butthead are usually clad in shorts, so even though they're wearing tactical pants on this patch, I think you can still feel an alliance with them. <laughs> that was cool. Fire, fire, fire. Tommy. Um, that was a really cringeworthy Beavis and Butthead impression. Tactical Beavis and Butthead. I fucking love this. Believe me, son. Me and my brother DC. We watched the piss out of Beavis and Butthead uh, whenever we were kids growing up. So this one got, oh, look at that, right there. Got a little spot in the, the place of honor, at least temporarily, for Beavis and Butthead. I don't know what that could be. And I'm looking from, and you know, here's the funny thing. I'm looking at the address here, and this is from a client. Like a law client. I mean, of course it's a law client. What other clients would I have? Oh, you guys are going to run with that, aren't you? Son of a bitch. All right. <clears throat> Dear James, it's your neighbor from Lafayette. I don't have anything profound or funny to say, but I enjoy your videos. You and the whole TFB crew are great. Anyway, I sent you some beer, clinching, chuckling. Duckling. Including my university's officially licensed beer. I also threw in an I also threw in an AUG A A U G AUG Lafayette. Lafayette. Bay I also threw in I also threw in an AUG bayonet I had lying around. Some people don't see the point of a bayonet, especially the AUG, but it's the side opposite of the handle. That was a joke, Jake. That was a joke and a good one at that. Keep up the good work, Jake, boy genius. Thank you, Jake. Can't wait to see what kind of beer is officially licensed for some special needs school in Lafayette. Ragin' Cajun's Genuine Louisiana Ale. Oh, Bayou Tesh. All right, this is going to be good stuff probably. Thank you, Jake. Look at this. We got a Polliner Stein and a big ass can of Polliner in here. I love Polliner, by the way. Um, Munich was like one of the most fun trips I've ever taken in my entire life. Hopefully I'll find the pictures, but here's Miss Debbie. You guys remember I had Miss Debbie on Mailroom a couple of years ago, my, my mother-in-law. Here's Miss Debbie absolutely housing a beer at uh, Beer Garden, or I forget which one. Uh, gosh, it's the big one in Munich. Hofbrau House, Hofbrau House. This is Miss Debbie crushing brews. Like, I think I had to pick her up like a like a baby and walk her up the stairs whenever we uh, we got back to the the hotel. So Miss Debbie had a great time. I had a great time. This is going to bring back some memories. Thank you, Jake. I'm going to bill you only 0.1 hours for opening up your mail. That about wraps it up. Pretty pedestrian mail room for April Fool's Day and an otherwise watershed moment. One million subscribers, which meant a big deal to me personally. You're sick of me saying it and being a sappy little bitch but you guys mean a lot to me, and I'm appreciative that I get to do this with you. So, um, you see me in the street, stop me, say hey. You see me in a bar, I will buy you a beer. 
Thanks for a million, boys. Thanks for all the mail. Thanks for the laughs. I'm going to be here. I'm going to try to be better at being a, a better content creator for you guys. I'm going to fail miserably at it, so don't expect anything. I mean, that's a totally hollow promise. A completely hollow. It will be unfulfilled, but I still love you, and I hope you love me back. Have a good night, guys.